Hello guys, my name is Tarusha and today I am going to show you how you can create a telegram bot using Google Dialog Flow. So we can ask several questions and the bot will reply using Google Dialog Flow. So let's start building the bot. So the first thing is you need to create a telegram bot. So to create a telegram bot, you just need to go for bot search for bot father and create a telegram bot once you create the telegram bot the second thing you need to do is you need to sign up in the google dialog flow so it's so easy you can sign up with your google account once you sign up with your google account you will be needed to create a google agent so once you create an agent you will come up to an interface like this so let me explain you the interface and options that are available so these are the in this side you will have intents so these are the things that we are going to use in this project entities knowledge fulfillment integration training in here we will be able to add new intents so intents means like when we type something it will identify that this is a part of this and it will give the reply back to us so in here we can do the testing of the intents that we created so in this project i'm going to create a bot that can reply with some amazon links of some products so Let's start building the bot. You need to get the token of your Telegram bot and go to integration and find Telegram. Click it and you need to place the Telegram token here. Once you place the Telegram token, you can either start it or keep it till you fully develop the project so the next thing is you will see default intent it means that it comes with some intent to do give some replies so default welcomes so in case if you will say hi hey there likewise it will give these responses and also it will be able to identify if you type just as high so basically it will give the reply even though the user has some missing words in the line so so the first thing is i will create something to interact with what i'm going to do is i'm going to space copy and paste some saying like select what you want so user will know user will select either one or two so then I will send if the user select food or if user select clothes, I will send some links of food or clothes, but it will come in the next step. So first we will change all the default response as we want. Okay, so now we can save it. And we can now do some testing here if we type hi okay so now it says how can i assist you select what you want one clothes two food okay so now we can create a new intent so the next intent is if user select one 
so we will name this as clothes if you select one oh if you uh, type clothes we can add the response as these links so then we can save it so now we can go for the new intent create a new intent and it's going to be food training phrases are two So the food responses will be these links. So now we have done our small conversation part. Now we will go for the integration and telegram and start the bot or oh, once we click this it will start the server now we can go for the telegram bot so this is my telegram bot and we can say hi so now he says hi how are you doing select what you want so if I think I need clothes, I will select clothes. And what we send a message of a cloth link. If I say another cloth, it will sell. So we can randomize this until if we had enough of the values to send as the output we can randomize it so if you say hi again hello how can i help you select what you want i will press 2 as food so we send food links so likewise we can use dialog flow to create a conversation or a telegram board so we can use training validation fulfillment likewise we can upgrade this project to do much and much more with different branches so i hope you guys enjoy and get some knowledge on how you can build a telegram bot using google dialog flow until we meet again see you and make sure to subscribe my youtube channel for more more videos like this